still talking about the Olympics, and why not? It really was unbelievable. <laughs> it was so fun. We're fortunate to have one of the athletes with us now, Lindsay Berg, the captain of the U.S. women's volleyball team, which won the silver medal. There's a shot of you guys mm -hmm. right there. <laughs> All right, Lindsay, it wasn't the first thing I asked you about, but I bet everyone asked first about that beautiful medal around your neck. Yeah, I'm so <laughs> blessed and lucky to be to have this, and um, mm -hmm. it's my second, and the journey was incredible and I'm oh, still get a, get a, get I'm get still getting the goosebumps as I sit here you? talking about it thinking about it and it was just incredible and, and you said it's very heavy the metals yeah heavy, it's which I noticed right now it's not comfortable really to wear it mm -hmm. and uh -huh. I feel like my neck's going down <laughs> but I mean I'll wear it it's great it's amazing now you guys went in this was the second time the rematch between the United States and Brazil and this time you were the favorites and you came out with the silver Tell I me know about it. Um, it's hard to go into a match uh, we beat them maybe the last seven eight times and they were hungry out there to get us and the most important match too bad they had the match of their life we had an average match but we aren't losers I still believe we're number one in the world I still believe we're a gold medal team and we came out with the silver but it's still an incredible experience it is and how do you deal with the pressure I mean you, you go there as an athlete London you're representing our country you want to win a medal you want to win the gold but yet in the in the sport that you pick it's there's also the, the sex appeal part of it there you know, you're wearing those little costumes you know and you're, you're, you're a good-looking lady I mean that yeah. that adds a lot of pressure to it doesn't it? Uh, yeah we try not to deal with outside pressure and if there's any pressure it's just our pressure on ourselves to be the best that we can be and this team handles the pressure of being mm -hmm. number yeah. one look, look at incredibly this, yeah. and um, <laughs> yeah this was this shot came out and it caused a little mm -hmm. bit of a stir because it's the team posing nude for ESPN but I look for you Lindsay you're not in that shot yeah um, seven girls got picked and it was before our team got announced we don't announce our team till the beginning of July but anything I feel that our team can show how much hard work we put in and this is just showing the woman's body or the athlete body of how much you work out mm -hmm. and it was great for us. We're a sport that doesn't be seen a lot, and it was incredible, and I'm happy the girls did it. I was going to say, though, does that take away, though, from all the athletic hard work you do? I mean, you know, God bless you, you really uh, you apply yourself to it, but then, you know, you have that other part, and people say, yeah, they're just good-looking girls, beach girls, and they're having a good time. Yeah, no, I think it's incredible that we can be all around people and to, to show that these women are beautiful, and we're athletes, and we work just as hard as men, but we're still beautiful women. Did you see Tim, women. Tim Tebow on the cover of oh, GQ? Oh, yeah, I've I mean, seen, I, we do with Tim, I've seen right? it all. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So were you one of those people who walked into the Olympics with your camera and you were, you know, the opening ceremonies? Yeah, opening ceremonies never gets old. I did my third mm -hmm. this Olympics and still goosebumps. I cried tears again. Mm -hmm. And everyone now has their phones in everywhere you go. And everyone was filming and taking pictures of each other. And it's just the most incredible experience I've ever Ever been in. And it, it, it's a moment that ties not just our country, certainly, but the whole world. Well, exactly. I mean, the enormity. I of mean, that. to be in the presence of that many people that have the motivation, yeah. desire, and focus that you have, and to be around everyone in different countries, the whole world, everyone is uh, supporting you. It is incredible. You're retiring, I hear. I am. Lindsay, um, how long have you been playing volleyball? <laughs> Since I was six or seven. <laughs> and, um, 23 to 24 years, do the math, but. Um, <laughs> How are you, I'm, what are you gonna do? Uh, I have so much. Uh, I've been approached to write a book of my story. It's a long story and it's a good one. Um, I'm really into fashion and wanna go in that area as well. Um, I wanna make a difference in people's lives mm -hmm. and I'm gonna try to do it in different areas and promote our sport and mm -hmm. we've got some good role models on the team and that I think need to be out there. I you already so. made a difference because you, made, yeah, us, you made, made us feel great good. Difference. You awesome. made us feel yeah, good. You put a smile, made us proud. Made us proud. Right. And, and that's a great looking Olympic jacket yeah, you have on there that. too. It's I our medal ceremony jacket and yeah. Nike nice. did a good job and they sure did. Yeah, you get the opening ceremony, the medal jacket. Yeah, we've <laughs> we've got it all. <laughs> yeah. Thanks Lindsay. Thanks, Thank you job. for having me. Thank you. Thank you so much.